Okay, hopefully, hopefully these gentlemen will keep talking, but I just installed a BHI DSP unit into my Kenwood TS440S today, and it was relatively very simple. The instructions online are great uh, that the uh, guys did over in France. Between them, Graham and W4RT, Ralph at, uh, at W4RT, yeah, they have a winning product, man, all the way around. This is awesome. Uh, you'll see what I'm saying. I'm going to go through the different levels. I have it in uh, four mode. It can go up to what's known as eight mode. That's done by pressing the power button, but you got to hold the button in back there. So anyway, I just want to give you a look of where I put it. I actually installed it back towards the rear because that's where you have to hook up everything anyway. And I put it over in, into the vent. And why not? Heck, the slits are already there. May as well make it uh, into the vent. Looks pretty cool, actually, I think. That's what she looks like. I got a couple guys that are kind of weak now with their voices, uh, and I want to show you what this filter can or cannot do. So let's go ahead and check it out. You can hear the band. It sounds kind of hashy like it always does. And now don't. Sound hashy that is. There's level one. Level two. Level three. Level four. Now this guy is weak. At least. Well, I'll show you. See, he's a little bit weaker. With this, boy, does it clean that hash up. I love the fact it takes that static away. It's so awesome. And that's what can be done with that guy. It was fun putting this in. It fits in perfectly. I can take the lid on, take the lid off, still have my BHI in there. It won't affect anything. comes right off. I can lift the center and the back up like this forward, and it takes everything that's on there up, and it doesn't affect anything by putting the install. I've taken lots of pictures online, and uh, or of this rather, and I got them posted online. I'll show you level 8 mode real quick here. Let's go ahead and do that. So, to do that, 